Hello class! Welcome to today's math lesson. Today, you and I are going to be doing some measuring. And we're going to be measuring today with some rulers. So I would like for you to make sure that you have one. We are going to be measuring in feet and inches. Hmm. Do you remember how many inches are in one foot? I'm going to give you a hint. It is a dozen inches. Do you remember how many are in a dozen? Did you say 12? Well done. We are going to be measuring by feet and then if our item is tall enough, we're going to be measuring with inches as well. Today I would like for you to measure yourself and you could be measuring a friend or someone at your house as well. I want you to guess or estimate how tall you might be in feet and in inches. Hmm, it's kind of hard for me to measure myself. So I am going to be measuring some fun pictures on the wall. Class, I thought it would be fun for us to measure the height of this flower. I have two rulers because I think it's easier to measure when you have two. So I'm going to put the first one right down on the ground. One foot, two, three, four, five, and we're going to take a close-up look at how many more inches. So it's five feet and not quite six feet. So how many inches? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten inches. The flower is five feet and ten inches long. Hmm. Do you think that the pink flower is going to be taller than or shorter than the blue flower that we just measured? Use me for some comparison. I'd like for you to estimate how tall you think this flower may be, and I'm going to measure it using feet and inches. One, two, three, four, oh, five feet. I don't even need any extra inches. The pink flower is five feet tall. Do you remember how tall the blue flower was? It was five feet and ten inches. Hmm. How tall do you think our little inchworm is? Could you estimate or have a, a good guess of how tall he might be? Let's check it out. Do you have an estimate for how tall the inchworm might be? Well, let's measure. I'm going to start at the very base of the inchworm. This is one foot and I'm going to use my second ruler for the next, for the next part. And, hmm, it's about that tall. So let's count it. It is one foot and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine inches. Let's take a closer look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One foot and nine inches. Oh class, thank you so very much for measuring with me today. I hope that you have some fun measuring things around your house or your classroom. Remember, when we measure with our rulers, we can measure on either side. One side has inches and they're a little bit longer and there's 12 of them on your ruler and there's 12 inches in a foot. The other side of your ruler might have centimeters and there's about 30 centimeters in a one foot. Have fun measuring and thank you so very much for learning with me today. Have a great day class. Bye-bye.